Hello there, Daniel Williamson here, uh, enthusiast on all things Scottish. Uh, something I do is I wear a kilt a lot, um, just sometimes for just the sake of it or for when I'm going to an event. Um, I'm in North Carolina right now, it's about 90 degrees weather, so it's pretty hot and humid. I'm not wearing any kilt hose. Um, Scots didn't, well his, historically Highland Scots were known as being barefooted and barelegged anyway most of the time, so I'll let you argue over that amongst yourselves, but anyway. This video is about um, a way to get into a car in a kilt. A lot of times when people first start wearing a kilt, they say, I'm having a terrible time figuring out a way to get in a car in a kilt and keeping my pleats nice and neat. Well, honestly, let me show you something. I'm sure my pleats are in good condition. I've already done uh, three errands today, and I'm actually home now. Um, but anyway, the way I do it is I use a leather belt. Now, you can use your kilt belt and undo it and get yourself in there, but I usually just grab a, a pants leather belt to do this. Now, what you do to get in is you take your belt and you, you sweep around your buttocks like this, okay? And then you slowly get in like that and sweep it out. And your pleats should be in good shape. get out just like that and they should be good so anyway I'm not saying this is the only way on how to get into a car and a kilt but this is a good way and this is how I do it at least I think it's a good way I hope you enjoyed this and I hope this can help you if you need it thank you